What's up, super folks? I'm here with another review for the Super X uh, Tron uh, themed Flynn joggers and hoodie. I've got them both here for you right now. Um, I'm go ahead and pull them out, try them on, and uh, yeah, we'll get to it. We'll start out with the hoodie really quick. Pop this guy on here. Very, very clean. This first impression right off the bat, very, very clean. This is actually a silver. I thought it would be like wider, which is great. Looks better in person than it does on the camera. I'm not going to lie. Lighting seems a bit dim, but this is actually a reflective material, and uh, it's like silver kind of metal-y, which is actually pretty cool. It's supposed to reflect in the dark, you know, very Tron sort of theme. Um, but uh, yeah, I see some white stitching here on what looks like the chest piece, which I'm very glad that they did because I feel like they don't highlight the chest very often necessarily um, at first glance I thought maybe this design would be too too plain and I suppose it is in some sense it's just you know black with like two sort of strips here and that to some extent is I suppose true but uh, it does look a lot cooler in person than I thought it would here's your Tron Flynn. Uh, nice. So, yeah, in terms of the design, it is. It's essentially like two um, sort of reflective ribbons, I guess, or sturdy strips, uh, plus a couple extras going around. Um, I really bought this for the profile, and you guys are going to see this when I put it on. But um, it's very good material, as for the usual. It's a nice little stretchy, very nice. I think my biggest gripe is probably fact that we have super white sort of zipper pocket like it just it just sticks out a lot um, might go with the uh, Brock joggers that I've got so that might be cool but nice comfortable pockets they're reasonably sized they can fit a phone I'm pretty sure like a standard phone um, I think the big gripe is that it comes in and then it goes out and again like it does great on the top part and the arms are fine but and I'm glad that the chest is highlighted at least, but then it's then it comes in and out, and I'm like, well, a lot of people don't have the best figure in the world, and they want to look okay at it, but if you highlight it and with uh, expanding lines going out, you, you expand sort of that shape. Now, I do think that this kind of coming in here at the chest is going to look good, but I am kind of bummed that they didn't bring in, like, taper in these back in, getting down, especially since these like very bright white zippers that aren't really hidden very well at all uh, they come out they step in so I don't know that's just a little gripe but very good material I like the reflective strips I like the color I like that it's silver gray as opposed to I don't know I thought it was going to be all white glad it's not uh, you've got the classic sort of I can't remember what this is called like an A fold or something here to help you with the bunching that's great let's go ahead and look at the back Got the got the X on the back, which is pretty cool. This is not going to come off, which is nice because a lot of the, sometimes you get the lightning bolt, which I'm actually curious where the lightning bolt is. I do like the lightning bolt, but and a lot of the times, like the Super X, I feel like they don't do a lot on the back, but this one they do. It's kind of like an open sort of tapering down from the shoulders back down into the waist area, so that's cool. And I do like the hard feel of this X. It's just like stitch in here I suppose but um, yeah and you get your hood and that's pretty much it let's go on to the joggers mm. the joggers my biggest concern I think for this is actually that I would probably these are extra larges so it might be too big for me oh this is cool so the crotch piece right off the bat you feel right here has like sort of a breathable crotch area which is actually great um, I am a bit worried these are going to be too big because it's an extra large and they resized it so everything kind of went up a size. I was doing okay on the extra large on the other ones. But this is why I bought it, man. This is going to look good profile. Like, I don't know if you can see it, but this is going to look good profile. So I'm just designed profile when you're standing sideways and reflective. There's your minimalistic kind of X. I do like that it's not super obvious. It's something that I do appreciate about that they never change it. Uh, there's no cuff thing, Velcro or whatever, which I'm actually okay with again. I think that was a good decision. It's a very simple design. 
Let's see, we got pockets on the back. There's no pockets on the back. There are zip pockets on the sides. Pretty good, decent size, very reasonable pocket size. You got a string around the waistband, which is pretty solid. That makes sense. Um, but yeah, so I'll fold this up really quick. Boom. Sort of. These are extra large, so I am a little concerned this might be too big for me. This is, actually, I'm really bummed already that the size has changed so much. But anyway, so that's that. I'm going to go ahead and try them on, and uh, we will see how they look. And here it is. The Flynn full suit. You got the hoodie, and you got the joggers. Um, I'm actually very surprised how the extra large is fitting on me. Um, I was probably, I mean, I still think the optimal size for me is a large, and that's probably what I'll do. Just to make sure that, like, the design, for example, on the legs, it fits, it looks good. It just, I'm not tall enough. <laughs> it's just not long enough to justify an extra large. And the same kind of thing for the hoodie. Um, the pockets are just deep enough where it's like I can't, I mean, I can reach in and grab them but uh, it's just a little bit longer than I'd like it to be. But overall, very actually surprised with the flint. I thought I might be disappointed by the, the two simplistic sort of strips. I'm hoping putting it through the wash isn't going to do too much damage at all. Um, you're not supposed to dry these. You're supposed to air dry them. Um, so I'm hoping that this will be fine. But uh, yeah, no, it's a, it is a simple design. They actually got the hood, I think, pretty deep, at least for the XL. But the hood is finally done. You could probably can always take another inch right there in the front. But overall, you know, they get to here's the back without the hood, with the hood up. It's actually good there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Back with the hood down. I had to roll up the sleeves too because they're a little bit, um, just a little too long for me. Maybe I'll try to exchange it. We'll um, see. I'll see how that goes. I'm sure that tags it. So. But I do like, especially what they did here, they got one, two, three of these strips, and that they kind of run and they kind of do their own thing. That's very Tron like. I feel like they kind of, it just, they lost it when it got up here. It just, and then they simplified it down to one. Would have liked to see some, some kind of a strip up here, something up here, and then maybe a shoulder piece to kind of finish it out. Obviously, there's a lot of ways you could go with the next iteration one day and decide to do it. But, like, that would be a nice, the shoulder cut is a really good, just seam to have uh, highlighted, just because it highlights the shoulders and the shape. Um, especially if you're to work out here, which is what this is supposed to be. If I can get one side down, I probably will do that, but worst case scenario, I can handle it. Um, legs are good. I do like the simplicity. I think I think it rivals Adidas, honestly. I like Adidas and Nike stuff. Pretty simple. If I can get, get that in there. So, yeah, I do. I would have liked a little bit more stitching. Another one too is like sort of this reflective material coming out on the inside would have made a lot of sense um just would have added a little bit more but i do like that it is minimalist and if that's what they're going for then that's what they did especially with the joggers um the other huge huge win for the suit is the inside this sort of uh quick dry i guess sweat resistant material it's pretty nice um right there on the crotch side with the crotch seam probably will help and minimize ripping and tearing as well. These are also very stretchy. Um, it is a lot of material, so it does feel, it's kind of heavy, you know. It's fine for your warm-up or when it's cold, if you're in a place that you need to go to a gym when it's cold. Uh, it's not bad. Um, I do especially like this arm part here. That part I think is sweet. But, um, yeah. 
there you go. If your clinic comes in here, this is all good. I think this is fine for me with the chest. You could have just had it come with this little chest in here, but I thought at least there's something here highlighting your chest. And it goes down. I wish it didn't go out. I wish it went here and then kind of came in and down. That would have been a huge win for me. Probably wouldn't have been one of my favorites. But still cool. Still dig it. Still going to work. Still going to use it a lot, probably. Um, if I can get a size smaller, especially. Um, yeah, man. That's pretty much it. I'm just going to do a couple more of these little poses here. Mm -hmm. I'm just a, you know, I don't really know much about it. I did see the Tron. I don't know if I saw the original one. I don't know too much about the main character. So I don't know what his like, poses are. But this is like kind of, this almost feels like futuristic Assassin's Creed in a way. But it's deeper than it's usually. Like guys, I can always take an extra inch up here just to prevent like, the sun from coming, but I do like that. I also never really used it, like, so put it just there as kind of an accessory. But anyway, I'm going to do this. I don't, know. I don't have a disc that would be cool that I would be going about for you or something. That's good, man. Anyway, to the program, I think, is what they say or something like that. But um, if you enjoyed this this uh, product, if you enjoyed this review, uh, please go ahead and use code Transcend Savers in the channel name currently um, at the discount at the checkout part of their site, superx.co. Um, with that said, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time.